In this video, I will show you how to get uh, the QGIS API set up so you can use it in a Python command line or uh, in a Python script. So the first thing you'll want to do is you want to come to QGIS.org um, and then you want to download QGIS. So if we come down to download now and I'm on Windows, so I'm going to use the Windows download. They have these standalone installers for QGIS Desktop. What we want is the for advanced users, and you're going to click on the OSGO 4W Network Installer 32-bit. I have not yet figured out how to get 64-bit to work, uh, but I, I have got 32-bit to work. So you're going to download that. I already have it downloaded, so I'm going to skip to the next part. Once you get that downloaded, uh, you'll have this OSGO 4W folder uh, on your C drive. And now before we can do anything else, we need to go and modify our path and Python path variables. So I'm going to come to my start menu and I'm just going to search for environment variables. And you want to edit the system environment variables. So we'll do that. Uh, come down here. So this is also in system properties, the advanced tab come down to environment variables and down here where it says system variables I'm going to I need to add a path first of all I'm going to make a new variable and I'm going to call this Python path all caps and the variable value is going to be this OSGO 4W it's going to be apps QGIS Python Grab this, copy that link there, come back to the variables, paste the link here, OK, OK. Go back to environment variables, I'm going to come down to the path variable, and I need to edit this one as well. So let's edit path. Um, we're going to be in the same directory, apps, QGIS, bin. We need access to these DLLs. Copy that. We'll come back over, paste that in at the beginning, add a semicolon, OK, OK, OK. Now, with any luck, uh, we should be able to get this to run. So let's go back to start. I'm going to find the OSGO 4W shell. Now, I need this one to run. And there's, it's just in two different spots. I have QGIS installed twice. Um, so it's the same shell. Let's open this up. Uh, type in Python to get a Python console going here. Okay. So let's see if this works out okay. Um, so we need to do import qgis.core and I get an error. There's no module. Now I think that's because this Python is 64 bit and I should have pointed it uh, to a 32 bit. The problem could just be that I opened up the wrong console. So I come in here. And I believe this, yep, here we go. There's the, there's the console, Python. There we go. See how it says 32-bit now? This should be the right one. Import qgis.core. And I don't get any errors there. Okay, so now we're ready to go. And we can get on to developing with uh, the QGIS API for Python.